India's real pandemic death toll could be in the millions. New research out Tuesday says fatalities in the hard-hit country could be 10 times the official government tally of about 415,000, a number already believed to be a dramatic undercount. According to the U.S.-based Center for Global Development, India experienced up to nearly 5 million excess deaths since the start of the pandemic through to last month. While not all would be COVID-related, researchers say true deaths are likely to be in the several millions, not hundreds of thousands, making the coronavirus arguably India's worst modern human tragedy. India's government has previously dismissed reports that the death toll could be much higher. Now, a separate study by Indian officials just found that two-thirds of the country's population are believed to have coronavirus antibodies, meaning they've come into contact with the disease. That leaves, they say, a third of the population still vulnerable. Wherever you are, out of three of you, one is still vulnerable. And therefore, the pandemic is in no way over. The outbreak in India, driven in part by the variant first detected in that country, known as Delta. In the U.S. Tuesday, the director of the Centers for Disease Control revealing just how widespread that variant has become south of our border. The Delta variant now represents 83 percent of sequenced cases. This is a dramatic increase from, from up from 50 percent the week of July 3rd. In some parts of the country, the percentage is even higher, particularly in areas of low vaccination rates. She adds COVID fatalities have risen by nearly 48 percent over the past week to an average of 239 per day in the U.S. Last week, the head of the CDC said this is becoming a pandemic of the unvaccinated. Melissa Duggan, City News.